हेलो एवरीबॉडी आई एम अनुराग मिश्रा एंड इन दिस क्लास वी शैल स्टडी इंग्लिश ऑफ क्लास ट्वेल्व नेम ऑफ द चैप्टर इज लॉस्ट स्प्रिंग एंड दिस चैप्टर हैज बिन रिटन बाय एनिस जंग लेट मी टेल यू अबाउट द ऑथर फर्स्ट एनिस जंग इज एन इंडियन ऑथर सी इज ए जर्नलिस्ट एंड कॉलमिस्ट फॉर न्यूज पेपर इन इंडिया ऑल्सो एंड फॉर एब्रॉड ऑल्सो सी वॉज बॉर्न इन नाइनटीन हर फेमस वर्क इंक्लूड्स Unveiling India and it has been about India and she has basically written about Indian women especially Muslim women and as for us this chapter concerned this is story the story lost spring has two parts it has two parts first part is sometimes i find a rupee in the garbage and the main protagonist main character in this story is sahib e alam who has come from dhaka to india and uh, he does the work of rag picking the second part as you can see here i want to drive a car in this story the main character is mukesh who is from firozabad he is a boy and he works in bengal making industry so let's talk about these two parts one by one first of all let me introduce you this story lost spring by any jung shows the plight of children in india it shows how small children are exploited they are not uh, entitled to live as a children they cannot enjoy their childhood so let's talk about first part sometimes i find a rupee in the garbage and this part sometimes i find a rupee in the garbage the main character is sahib alam who his family and other people came from dhaka bangladesh to india they were settled in simapuri near delhi and all the children does the work as rag pickers even elders also do the same thing for them rag picking is a job but for children it's a fun they earn some money and they search for gold gold means earning livelihood in the garbage they find a rupee or two and they lead their life they live their life like that only any jung meets sahib and she asks why do you do this work so he told i don't have any other work if you open a school for me i shall study and any jung promised mockingly okay i will open a school come one day then when sahib met her in future he asked any jung is your school ready i am ready to study and she was embarrassed she told okay okay and after some days some months any jung saw sahib was working in a tea stall he was earning 800 rupees with all the mills but uh, when any jung saw the tea containers in his hand she thought even uh, sahib felt that uh, he is no master of his own he is the slave of somebody else now let's uh, talk about second part i want to drive a car by mukesh mukesh is the boy of firozabad he works in the bengal in industry and uh, he had a dream to drive a car but he, his dream cannot be fulfilled because his four fathers his father grandfathers were in the clutches of sahukars landlords that uh, they had to work in the bengal industry as you all know bengal industry requires hot temperature high light so all the children lose their eyesight when they become adult they become blind even mukesh grandfather is blind when any jung enters mukesh house she saw her sister in law she saw his elder brother's wife cooking and their house was not proper that was very that was of mud any jung inquires and the elders said that it is their karam it is their destiny and uh, but mukesh had a dream to drive a car she thought oh oh she thought oh that mukesh could fulfill his dream he could become a motor mechanic so by these two stories any jung has shown 
द कंडीशन ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ चिल्ड्रेन इन बोथ द स्टोरीज नाउ स्टूडेंट्स आफ्टर द एंड ऑफ द चैप्टर आई हैव रिटर्न समरी द समरी इज वेरी एफिशियंट एंड आई हैव गिवन सम क्वेश्चन आंसर ऑल्सो आफ्टर गोइंग थ्रू द समरी ट्राई टू अटैम्प्ट दिस क्वेश्चन एंड आंसर थैंक यू